Welcome to a complete understanding of GenCodex, a revolutionary platform that simplifies software requirement specification SRS, documentation. In this video, we'll take you step by step through the process, showing you how GenCodex automates SRS generation and seamlessly integrates with low-code, no-code development platforms. AI-generated SRS and project generation. Initial input parameters. To begin, users provide key input parameters. First, enter the project name. In our example, we'll be working with the loan process system. Next, select the project type from the drop-down menu. If your project type isn't listed, simply choose others and manually input your desired type. Similarly, pick a project category. If your category isn't available, select others and enter it manually. Once the basic details are set, we move to the next step. Answering key questions. Now, Users answer eight essential questions that help define the SRS document. There are three ways to provide responses. Manual input type in answers yourself. AI-assisted input, sequential mode, generate AI responses one question at a time. AI-assisted input, batch mode, generate all answers at once using AI. For this demonstration, we'll use batch mode for faster results. Once all responses are in place, we move to the next step. Generating SRS content. At this stage, users click the Generate Response button at the bottom right corner. The system dynamically compiles the SRS document based on the provided answers. Reviewing SRS details. Once the document is generated, several crucial sections appear. Project idea. This covers the introduction, purpose, reason for development and objectives. Target users. Defines the intended users and their interactions. Users can add, modify, or remove users as needed. Primary use cases. Highlights the key functionalities of the project. Users can customize these use cases. Project scope and constraints. Defines the project's scope, limitations, and exclusions. User needs. Captures user expectations and solutions with options to modify entries. Assumptions and dependencies. Lists project assumptions and dependencies. Functional requirements. Provides detailed specifications, including workflows, inputs, outputs, and pre post conditions for each requirement. AI generated web page. GenCodex takes automation a step further by generating an HTML web page for any functional requirement. For instance, the user registration page is automatically created. Regenerate web page. If the page needs modifications, Users can click, regenerate web page, enter prompts, and refine the output. Once the web page is finalized, it can be approved for further GenCodex integration. Non-functional requirements. This section covers critical system requirements including capacity, compatibility, performance, security, usability, visual project representation. Additionally, GenCodex provides visual project representations like data flow diagram, offers a high-level overview of system processes, use case diagram, illustrates system interactions and key functionalities. External interface requirements, defines hardware, software, communication, and user interfaces. Finalizing the SRS document. Finally, once everything is reviewed and approved, users click Generate PDF to compile the complete SRS document. This action creates a finalized, readily distributable version of the specifications. This structured PDF blueprint consolidates all project requirements, including functional and non-functional specifications, use cases, diagrams, and acceptance criteria, making it an essential reference for developers, stakeholders, and teams throughout the project lifecycle. It serves as a single source of truth, ensuring clarity and alignment, 
and facilitating efficient communication and collaboration from initial development through future maintenance and updates. Auto page creation and modification in IDE. Now by clicking generated gen codecs that HTML created from SRS process automatically generates on gen codecs IDE. In this process gen codecs automatically generates HTML with Angular and if required validation automatically implemented in that particular form. In this demo you can see all registration from related files automatically generated and all code compatible with gen codecs IDE where you can modify form by drag and drop or also change properties from property windows. From properties of controls including label styling, advanced properties, also put events and map the APIs. From this demo we try to explain from GenCodex SRS AI powered process you can create entire product documentation including forms. That is automatically created in the GenCodex platform where you can alter the whole project with low code or no code. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more tutorials.